<laughs> Today's the day. Today is indeed the day that we get to go for a drive in the Mercedes. You didn't think I was going in that one, did you? Oh no, we can't do that. Not yet. And to be honest, I'm not actually sure when. But ladies and gentlemen, welcome your faces to a new dawn and a new day. Where today we are waking up in sunny, shiny Manchester. And oh boy, is it going to be a good day. My name is Tom and I film every single weekday of my life. And for some reason, upload it to the internet for your faces. Now, this obviously isn't usually where I start my days, but I've basically got an appointment with a doctor. And before you ask, yes, I am definitely getting Rita's rain whilst I'm down here. So we'll be back for some banging food once I fix this clicky shoulder. But we're currently making our way through the side streets of Manchester because we're going to this place called Block, where I'm hoping I'm going to meet a physiotherapist. Now, it really doesn't look like I'm in the right place to see a doctor, but apparently I am. What on earth? Sorry, this is just absolutely bizarre. I thought I was like walking into like a doctor's surgery or something, not a indoor forest. This is Sam. Nice to Are you going to sort me out and get me fixed? Sorting you out. Yes. Sorting you out. Thank you, bro. Well, <laughs> I didn't know this was going to come with a free massage. This is, this is well, brilliant. It often doesn't look quite like a massage. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, you start poking me on my shoulder again. <laughs> we're going we're to have problems. <laughs> Get you some range back. Amazing. I'm gonna do this pressing to your vertebra, okay? Yeah. So, what we want you to do, <laughs> don't sound too nervous, what we want you to do is take a breath in, okay, and breathe out. Number one, keep going. Oh! It's gonna turn into one of those videos, <laughs> isn't it? Wow, <laughs> cracking me. Wow, yeah. God, that felt nice. Yeah, good. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's mega. What an absolute legend. This is where it all starts. This is, I've got the physio, who's now going to be talking to a PT with me, getting the training exercises I need to do to start getting fit. Tom's tips that are going. Oh, and what a place that is. Like a shared work office environment. Absolutely loved it. But I've managed to organize with Sam, the physio, that I don't have to keep coming into the city center of Manchester. Instead, I can go to a place called Bury, which is way more accessible for me, but what a day. Just what a freaking day. I'll just say this right now. I'll be sad that I'm not coming into Manchester each time because look at this, man. Look at the culture. Look at, the, look at the bushes on the buildings. Bloody lovely. But not as lovely as Rita's reign. Oh, oh my gosh. Look at that. Wow. Six fusion boxes later. You better know I'm about to ransack the cake stand. <laughs> yeah, one of them, one of them, one of them. We'll go for one of these. Every single one of them. This one, that one, and that one. <laughs> I look like I've just done the weekly shop. But we've got Rita's reign, Piccadilly Bakes. And we are now bouncing back to the Syndicate Regional Office because, oh, ho, ho, ho. I am in some serious, serious trouble. So I'm trying to bribe them to not murder me. Right, the food is en route. However, as you could possibly tell, I've not turned up outside the office. I'm actually back at the Royal Mail because I do indeed need some delivery bags. Yeah, I'm hoping this is going to be enough. She said, get as many as you can. So I did do. See, you never know what's next in the life of Tom. Done and dusted. Yeah, that really is a lot of bags. And oh boy, are we going to need them? Because remember when I said we did like the 10% discount code for Alice being back at work? Well, you guys took it, ran with it, and we've had like possibly one of the busiest ever months we've ever had at Syndicate Original. Hence the bags. Come, 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 come. Family, I'm home and I've got more bags than a bloke on a Saturday night in a pub. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> did I get a lot? Oh, did I? Yes, bro. Did you say you want some bags? I got you some bags for your bags. Did I do a good job? Yeah. Do you remember all the times that I forgot to go and get bags? I thought I'd get a lot. I mean, these will last two days. Hi, vibes. Very nice. Is the sun Is there any gold? that it's keeps on shining? I have got you. Rita's rain. And guess what? Billy Bakes. And you get first pick this time. Yes, bro. Uber delivery. Uber Tom. Look how much I've got. Oh my God. Too much already. Why? Have you seen my front door? What? Wait, what's happened to your front door? Have you not watched my, my videos? On my what? Roll the clip. Oh, it is that time of the day again. The parcels from yesterday are still there. I was going to say what's outside. And bro. now we're adding more to it. I think it's Royal Mail bag I could find. Oh, is it? Right, yeah. You could fit a giant jelly cat in that. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> you try telling me you're not glad we're back at work. You try telling me that Code Alice 10 or whatever wasn't the best. Come on. <laughs> In fact, no, I'm what? To order more. Really? We, Mum and Nino came in yesterday to count all them boxes. Yeah. It's all sold. What? But, but. Oh, God, this oh, yeah. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. that's of me, too. <laughs> what? Where's the dumpling? I hope you don't say that to Carl. <laughs> Are you ready? Reet as rain. Yeah. Food review? Delicious. I'm thinking, I'm thinking a 10 out of 10. So good. Guess what, Nino? What happened to Nino this morning? What happened to Nino? You got spotted by a fan. No. Oh. I won on the premium bonds. What does that mean? Premium bonds. How much did you win? Five and a half grand. No, you didn't. Oh my God. No. Dude. No freaking way. 50 quid, 100 quid, 500 quid, <gasps> and a 5,000 quid. So. Well, with 50 grand. Oh my God. Syndicate original, go! Run, 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 run! Get yourself a TT, it doubles up as a table. By the way, where's he got that t-shirt from? I really like Why? that. We sampled it. What? Oh, we sampled I understand it. that you can't really see it, but wow, the actual, the colour of the material is really nice. It's Nino, one one. One suits one. you, sir. Super edition, um, oh my gosh. He'll sell it to you for another premium bond. <laughs> oh my gosh, mum coming in clutch. You put all them drinks in the fridge. Oh! Rita's rain out of 10. Fit 10. Told you. That looks like a freezer. Is this a fridge? Get me in! Why is there a bread maker in it? It's from your granddad's house. Don't make me feel bad, Nino, but why is it in here? Your mother is gonna bake bread. Good! Bake bread somewhere fucking else! Can't get in the fucking fridge! I left, I left for a year, <laughs> what? and that turned up. My mum said she was gonna make some bread in work. Oh, well, I'm so glad she got round to it. Oh, look at this! All the monsters got put inside the fridge, yes! Do I either have a Monster Energy Export? Oh, what's this one? A Monster Energy Ultra Peachy Keen. Ooh. I think I'm actually gonna go with this. I just don't understand what the difference of it is. I think it's the size of the can, and if that's the case, I love it, because I prefer monsters to be this small, rather than the dead big ones. So, taste test review. The survey says... <laughs> Lovely. I'm saying this right now, and I think a lot of people agree with me, that writing on the new hat should be black. It shouldn't be white. Oh, white. I think it gets lost in the design and the colour of it. Yeah. Don't tell Alice because she's probably gonna, she's probably gonna crucify me. Oh, she's there. Go mom, on, mom, mom, mom. Honest opinion. Do you think that hat should have black writing on it or white? Turn around, you know. White, probably. No, we're having it with white. We've got this. Oh, black. You can't read it. Can you? Run. Listen, I've not had a chance to see you since yesterday, so I just wanted to say high five to you and thank you for coming with me to see Deck. You're a legend. Oh, he's a really nice guy. So is my oh, family. I love you. Look who's at the house. Jenny Sequaqua. Oh, look at me, I'm pregnant. Oh, look at me, I'm having a little baby girl. And, oh, look at that. It's just a nice little dog. I've got you. Rita's rain for you and your Irish man. Oh, my God, you're so good. Sorry, it's all sweaty in the bag, but, you know, transporting it is not the best. But, honey, I'm home. <laughs> Come here, quick. Quick, 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 quick. Which one do you want? <laughs> Uh, uh, hi, babe. <laughs> I totally wasn't giving Jenny first pick. What, what are you talking? What are you talking about? Come, that, come, that come, 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 come. Oh, yes, I got one of every single one. Mm, in some yeah, case, in some cases, I got two. Oh, that's why. Are these the ones from last time that were? We, yeah, oh. Piccadilly Bakes. Now, there's a reason why I'm bribing Olivia first, and it's because I needed her to take me down. To the garage. Can you help me defend her? Because I do indeed believe it's fixed and ready for collection. I love you. Thank you for my lift. I can see it. It's all dirty. It looks great. <laughs> and look at that smile. And brilliant. The bad boy is back. We've got a brand new wind mirror on it. Because when I was last on the motorway, I went to look at it and it was facing down. We've had the water leak fixed off the aerial. And we've had the roofing sorted. And it's coming in at 109.49. And one Biscoffee biscuit. Brilliant. Next stop, sir, 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 Syndicate Original Office yet again, but this time, oh. Do I need to... Oh, wait, why are the blinds down? Because it's too hot with the sun. Oh. What the baby's eating? Why are you eating cake? I okay. brought the biscuits. We gave up. Have I'm you missed so a bit? You... Oh, you don't want any then? Oh, oh, no, it's f no, oh, no, it's fine. If you've got your cake, you can eat it. Hi, Alice. How happy are you to be back at work? Loving life. <laughs> I walked in and said, is that all the, all the orders? <laughs> We've already had a question today. <laughs> We've got a pick up today. Oh, wait, we have? Yeah. Bloody hell. Oh, side note, you know that we were talking to you guys about like the new uh, Syndicate Original Summer Collection? Well, you've seen this one, which is black. Then you've seen the sand one. Then you saw the blue one with the blue one. But I don't think you guys saw the blue with the purple. I'd love to know which one is your favorite out of all those in the comments down below. To which people are saying, when are we releasing it? Do we know? Oh, so you, you actually... pull your finger out and make oh. a decision. Sorry? 
as soon as you pull your finger out and make a decision. So it's up to me to decide when we're launching? No, it's up to you to decide on the design that you want me to send to print. Oh. oh, you know what? If I'm going to be back in the office, I'm going to start exploring what's going on. There's a box that says Tom shit in it, and then there's a box down here, and I found this! Oh! we got some music going, we're jamming. Karen, get your eyes on! We're having a boogie! Play the funky music! Excuse me, it's Officer Funk in the house! Ow! I'm back and I'm bringing the vibes to Syndicate Original. Karen, give me a, give me a boogie! Oh, show us your best moves! Oof, 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 oof. Mm. This is, this is what we do. I'm back in the office for like just two days and it's it's a funky fun house. I've also just managed to find this big chest or whatever this is up here, like a, a briefcase. Look at that, it's a razor briefcase. And inside it we shall find, we shall find. Ooh. It's a razor broadcast studio box. Ooh, that comes with key ring and everything. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to pause about the key ring because mum's got her uh, a boogie boots on. Look at those bad boys. What are those? I love it. Like, you know what? This is a brand new keyring. Mum, 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 mum. Put that in the next order. Free razor keyring two. Who's it going to? Who is it? Darren Wood from Wigan. Darren, for some reason, you've just won yourself a free brand new razor keyring, which I think is sick. Going in. Bye. Don't get me wrong. It's not exactly a spa or a cereal box with £100 in it, but... Oh my gosh! Shut up, you. All right, it's happening. Ladies and gentlemen, place your order now and you can you can win a second-hand bread maker. Oh my God, give it away. No, no, that's that's mum's favourite possession. Yeah, someone can win it. All right, we're giving away a smiley face pencil and it's going to someone called Home Home. home. From no, there's a name there, Jessica. Yeah, Jessica, is, Jessica Foster's. You accidentally put in the wrong details, but we've already had your order before. So you are the winner of a brand new smiley face pencil. Wait, hang on a second. What has she actually ordered? Uh, that, a medium charcoal yeah. LCS and... Or another t-shirt and a signed poster. Look at this. Best giveaway of the century there. Congratulations. Jessica from Wolverhampton. Give her a starburst. Give her... <laughs> give, 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 give the orange ones. No one likes give, the orange ones. Give her a starburst. <laughs> All right, back to whatever's going on in this corner of the office. Right, that needs to go. So let's push that off the other side. Oh, dear. And let's get down the box that is labelled Tom Shit. Nothing. There's no way. The first thing I've pulled out the box says Tom Syndicate, attention, Gordon. And it was sent all the way from San Antonio, Texas. And it said, if coolness were a sport, um, you'd totally take first place. See, we keep everything we've got sent, but I don't know what's inside this box. Ooh. Ooh. We got loads of stuff. Look at this. YouTube.com forward slash life of Tom. I like that. Hey, oh, it, it's, it's Phil from All The Ill. Postman Phil! There's no freaking way you're bringing us more stuff, Phil! Stop it! Get, wait, is it is it raining? Oh, look, it says, and Alan! Yeah! We love Phil, by the way. Thank you very much. I was going to say, swag him no, out right this, now. This is, this is an ongoing joke. No matter what the weather, he always has shorts on. That's what postmans do. <laughs> yes! I'm so glad we get to see the day that we pimp out Phil. Go on, boy! It should be getting them on now. Get those Adidas ones on. Get them free stripes gone. The, there's no... What are you about to sell us? I've won something else. What? Oh, God what have you won? Great. When I got my building control survey thing. Majig. Yeah, the survey completion document sent. You fill in a form as a survey, and uh, I've won a 25 quid voucher as well for something. <laughs> go, go and put the actual lottery on. Yeah. Just go to Tesco now and put the actual lottery on. What on earth is going on? You've married the luckiest guy in the world. He's pretty lucky. <laughs> what a day. Just winning all round, and we've managed to hook up the local postman. High five me. What's wrong with you? What's Ryan. wrong with you? Mommy, I'm How are you possibly tired? I'm doing a back return and I'm tired. Yeah. Stuffing. I'm great. How are you? <laughs> I'm good. High five. Scooby Dab. All right, what am I supposed to be doing for the rest of my day? I feel like there's a lot I'm supposed to be doing and I'm just not getting on with anything because it's just stress. chaos. How am I causing you stress? Yeah, just by existing. <laughs> What do you say? Your wife is just a million miles an hour. You're like a fly. Like, you come in and you go and you come back and you go and then someone else is there and then someone's on the phone and then your boy's knowing someone and then you're telling me and then you're her. Yeah. And I'm just trying to concentrate. Yeah, but the thing is, you've seen how busy my life is. And then someone turns up from Stoke smoking a weed. No, wait. Oh, mate, honestly, I just need to take a step away from Alice for a second. Just for record, someone from Stoke didn't turn up smoke, smoking weed. I bumped into someone from Stoke who was at the Grapes and it was lovely to meet him, but as I was talking to him, someone rolled up on a bike, smoking a spliff, shaking, was like, Tom, I've lived in the local area for 10 years, always wanted to meet you, can I get a picture? I was like, of course you can. But yeah, lovely to meet those guys, but I'm now back at the office and <sighs> just saying this. Wait, what? Where's it gone? Half me dinner's been nicked. Hang on a minute. 
Oh! Hey! Great success! I still didn't manage to eat like any of it. I'm absolutely starving. Come to daddy. Mmm. Still turn out, Chad. Nino, I am going to take a second to look inside the box because we had artwork. Wow. But then, do you want to see how incredibly talented my viewers are? Look at that. Diamanted, very nice. But then, check this out. Yes, how sick is that? Yeah, I love Honestly, that one. so much talent. Oh my gosh, when did we get this? How nice is that? <laughs> Look, it's is it like the Fantasia, like uh, Mickey Mouse yeah. scene? Oh. Wait, who's wait who's you know this? Really who's that? Who's yeah. this? That's me and Mickey Mouse. That's amazing. We've Carl? got the insignia, the Carl? SOG, Carl. Mum and me. Is it? Are we sure about that? I'm 99% sure that that could actually be Lydia instead. Me, Carl, Alice, Lydia, potentially. But either way, that is absolutely awesome. Oh, and I do like this one as well. Look at that. That's sick. You guys are so talented, honestly. I told you, we keep every single thing you guys send us, so thank you. So, Mum and Alice have... Because I, I, I wanted to, like, just have a bit of a break from P.O. PO Box and Box and stuff. But they were like, no, open I this don't, one. I don't want Someone's break. decorated it all nice. Put the address on it. They made it all starry. It says fragile, but it quite literally looks like it's been stood on. Oh. Mum, I don't think this package is for me. I think it's for you. <gasps> oh. It's not... Oh, wait, <laughs> controversial. It could be for the other dog. A mighty mutt's bone. Wait, it's someone's birthday recently. We've got... Oh, yeah. What is this? No. What? Oh! Oh, that's A cute. koala chew toy. That's cute. What is this? Ooh. Hey. What does the fox Oh, say? like that. Look at my dick. No. <laughs> <laughs> that actually made you laugh then, didn't it? Oh, and I got Whoa, what is that? A muzzle puzzle. And then is there anything else? Do yeah, people it's... know that you're having a baby and not a dog? A thank you for buying some. Oh, wait, thank Aww. you from Pet Lover Europe. And then. I'm not having a dog. And then we've got a letter. It says. To Tom and Twiggy! Mommy, Hi, Tom. Twiggy! Congratulations to you, Lydia, and the little jelly man, uh, jelly woman. My partner Dylan and I are a huge fan of yours, and we feel like uh, we're basically best friends with you at this point. I work at Central Interpair. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and we sell everything pet related from aquariums to ponds, dog toys to hams to bedding. I noticed that Hamster you always get presents for Jellyman and Arlo, but I never see anything for your mum's baby Twiggy. So I wanted to she's send not, She's not a baby, she's a fat blob. So I wanted to send something for your mum's fat baby to I'm joking. <laughs> so I wanted to send her a little box of goodies. I hope she loves them. There's one thing from each range that we sell in the box. So I'm sure she'll find something she loves. You can check out our products and find out more of them at pet petlove-europe.com. Oh, that's nice. It's there. It's there. And please don't hesitate to contact me if you have any questions regarding anything you're building of a pond in your beautiful garden. Thanks and <laughs> congratulations to the little one. Maddie and Dylan. Where's that thing? Mom, from up. Pet Love. Mum. Whoa! Look at all this. Oh, now she's got time. I Mum's like, Mum like, Mum wants chocolate sending to her. So no, there you she go. doesn't. There you go. Watch hashtag oh, ad. Say, put it on your foot. Sweaty forehead. Thank, thank you. Say thank you. Thank you. From Pet Love Europe. From Twiggy. <laughs> and Pet Love Europe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here contemplating whether or not I want to do another one because this box looks sick. And what are you saying in the background? Very well, mate. We're very nicely wrapped up. I know. Look at him. He's sticking out his bottom lips. He's like, Jellyman and Arlo get all the gifts. No, Mum gets all the... I was reading that. Oh, yeah, there you were. Je Nino's upset that has been sent for him. There? You've won fucking about 85 grand today. It's Beg it off. Like oh, go on then. We'll do, we'll do one more whilst we're in. Now, this one actually says fragile as well, as he just takes a Stanley knife straight to it. We're going in from the side. It's an Amazon box that's been You've not actually read what it says on the front. Well, it says open on the other side. Oh! That's beautiful! Aww. Oh my gosh! Tom and Lydia. Hello. Aww. Can I open it? Go on then. Oh. Oh, that's cute. The He's got two little legs. Oh, oh yeah. Thank the you. Egg. There you go. Oh, that's oh. adorable. Wait, I've got a letter. I've got a letter. I'm in. Oh, oh, it's a card. It's the. <gasps> oh, uh, keep, keep, look it, after that. She could frame that. Yeah. She could frame that. You ready? Whoa! He says, oh, my God. Hey, we're going to struggle with this one. Uh, to Tom and Lydia, please accept this replacement jelly cat to replace the duplicate we sent you last week. Oh, my God. That's the person who sent this. Wait, is it? You sending it the back. The one that I signed? I signed it and sent it back. Oh, my gosh. Right? That's uh, we not sent a, it last thing, week. a little bit told me that uh, it was one you really wanted, so I hope you like it. We would love to see your little jelly man with it once they uh, have arrived. Keep being amazing. Hope to meet you one day. All I love once again from Joe jo and John Richards. 
uh, from Worcestershire Sirs. That's who sent Ka uh, Arlo a BD card. Mum, I think you've been sent some sweets. Oh, oh no, it's a jelly man. Jelly man. Oh, yeah. I'm going to get them up for you. Um, oh, look at that rapid. Oh, what is it? Oh. Oh, yes. <laughs> Wait, look at Alice's face. No way, we said some chocolates. It was enough, but thank you. Oh. She messaged me on Instagram, yeah. Has you got a card on that? Yeah, you yeah. have to read that card, but oh. I was so actually speaking to her this morning because we thought the parcel was lost. That's why Phil brought it Oh, here. this is a lovely wrapping. Lydia would love this. Um, Lydia would be here with us, but she's currently shopping. But I have no idea what's going to be inside this. You know what it is, but we've been sent a... <gasps> No disrespect I know, yeah. anyway. <laughs> that is the best jelly cat out of the entire jelly cat company. Look, it's jelly man. So jelly man to me is actually a turtle. I don't know why, yeah. but that is jelly man's jelly. That is so amazing. I, I, I think I pronounced the names right. Yeah. Jo, Joe and John Richards from Worcestershire. Thank you so much for that. Lydia's going to lose her shit when she sees that. Yeah, she is. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm just now going on my phone texting Lydia about um, the jelly cat we've been sent. And Alice has realised that the card that she had on the front of the chocolates, oh, which is absolutely adorable. Wait, what's awesome. inside it? A oh, P.S. This picture on this card, card reminds me of Arlo and his giant jelly cat bunny. What's oh, the thing? What's the thing? Oh, it actually does. Thank you. You're so spoiled. Right, I'll see you later. Can't, can't even, I actually cannot, visit. if there was a fire now, we would be in trouble. All right, Mum, Nino, I love you. Alice, bye-bye. And I'm just going to leave you guys with this absolute madness. Don't forget, guys, as always, you can go to syndicateoriginal.com and buy yourself some merch. Oh, wait. You can't. You can't. We sold out. We haven't sold out everything. Oh. We sold out nearly everything. So if you don't, you, if you don't you go Use fast, code TOM1 for 1% off. No, it's not even good. <laughs> Come on. Do it. No. Put I it can't up. even do 1%, though. What, what, what's the biggest percent you can give off? You can't. Don't be trying to try and have a look. Try and see if you can do, to, do, do code Tom 1%. <laughs> if you try it and it works, it means it works. If it doesn't work, you can do it. Shout out to the 1%. Okay, love you. Tom 1. Tom 1. All right, love you, bye. Okay, bye now. Bye bye. Oh my gosh, we're finally out of there. Bloody hell. What a day. Hi, girl. You okay? Let me see the madness. Where is he? <laughs> hey, mate. Guess what I've got you. Go on. Guess what I've got you? A lettuce. A lettuce? Mm. Oh no, that's a jelly cat. It wasn't a jelly cat, but it is. First pick. Oh. The pick of the cakes. How about that? Mm -hmm. We stole the last ones, but guess what? I thought you might like some more. Well, we, can't, we can't play cat. We'll <laughs> you take no. any bites out of extra ones and we're going to have problems. No, that one is for Carl's mum. But you can help yourself to the rest. No, it's not. What? No, 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 no. Put it down. Let go. Let go. Let go. Stop. Oh, how dare you? How dare you take jelly, man? I can't believe you just ran off with a little shit. Hey, look at you doing granddad activities. Where is it? And grandma. Where is it? Oh, hey, mate. You having a nice time at grandma and granddad's? Oh, look at him. Look at him with his jelly cat, buddy. Hey, mate. You okay? <laughs> Poor kid's like, I can't escape this guy. <laughs> I don't know if I've got on camera, like, you two just adorably like that. That is amazingly cute. The sun behind you and everything. Look at him. <laughs> he's he's bloody perplexed as to what's going on. I'm here at the house that I'm not usually at, and the dog's just having the time of his life. Hey, yeah. Uh, hey, uh, mate. Hey, yeah. Uh. Oh, my gosh. I cannot escape you. Why are you following me? I told you my child was here. Didn't mean you were coming round. You're supposed to be at work. Did you get the code Tom one working? Oh, fancy seeing you it. By the way, we've just realised that your child is absolutely terrified of the squeaking duck. We just squeaked it in front of him and nearly cried. Has he ever sleep? Yes. About three quarters of an hour. Perfect. I know. And he's had a poop in. Working and, mummy missing. And, oh. This yeah. man makes me go away from you. Why well, was it my fault? I just get blamed for everything. All right, we're going to go try and perform a bit of a magic trick here. You ready? Yeah. And action. He's actually... <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Has he seen Grandad? He's seen Grandad. Oh. I can't wait for our little jelly man to arrive, honestly. 
I'm so excited. Now, I've shown this to people with iPhones, but I'm going to show you that if you have a smartphone, an Android, and you hold the side button, you can set a reminder. Really? Oh, what did she say? Remind me tomorrow at 1pm that I'm a smelly, farty man. I don't. Shall I tell you something? Sure. It's been saved. <laughs> Shall I tell you something? He knows that you do that. Why? So when you've... Oh, you've done it in I've been past. exposed. You've done it in the past. Yeah. So Not all you, the time. When you go, he always checks his phone and deletes any. So Damn he it. Knows. I, wonder what else, I don't really know Android, so I don't know what else I could do to it. I don't know. I don't, even know how to say, I don't even know how to change a wallpaper on an Android. I feel like an old man trying to do it. I'm like, what? Oh, there's no way. Oh, come on. It's not still happening. Alice, well, to be fair, though, I did just see Alice drive off on the CCTV. But, oh, no, that's not did good. It yeah, I had it fixed, but he did say if the water damage has got to the rest of the wiring and stuff, it's a much bigger problem. Um, and I think it's safe to say... It's a much bigger problem. Oh, that's not good, Dad. I just got it back from the garage today. Damn it. As we say in the business, back to the drawing board. Guess what I got you? What? Cornflake cake. <gasps> no way. <laughs> You're going to have to take it out of there because that's my half-eaten thing next to it. Sorry. Oh my but God, I got you. I got. Uh, it was a crunchy brownie or something. So you, you two are going to have to split that. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Bridge. Yes. oh yeah, yeah. Where'd you get that from? Where'd you get that from? <laughs> well, seeing as though I've bribed his mother, I can now bounce around to his house where it's feeding time at the zoo. Hey mate! Oh, Dude, this is the thing. So the PO box unboxing video hasn't even gone out yet to be like, oh, send us stuff. Because we keep saying to people like, oh, calm down. It's coming, but calm down. Because we don't need anything. We don't want anything. We're not being rude. But... I mean, Alice would... Yeah, no, to be fair... It, yeah, yeah, to, no, to be fair... Jelly <laughs> and I bet you've been bloody sent some, because look at this. Oh, my gosh. The front door of the house has been taken over. How often do you keep texting me? Every day. is like, come and get your P.O. box. Come and get your P.O. box. Because, like, it goes to the P.O. box, but then... Because Alice wants to like ransack it all, it gets sent to here, so she's just got them all. This is a bloody IKEA bag, which is massive, mashed full of jelly cats. Where's where's the Syndicate Royal Mail sticker on the side of this thing when I need it? Oh my god! And then I've still got all this stuff. Absolutely mad. But you know what? I think these are letters, and I'm actually really looking forward to reading these because, like, when I'm in the massage chair, I just sit, read them. And enjoy what you guys have to say. Whilst I'm trying to fill up the Defender, can you hear a little Arlo in the background singing? You just do we... walk up now. Yeah, do we just... Oh. <laughs> what are these noises he's making? He's like a little animal. <laughs> Did you say Is he looking? <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> I just sort of knows you get. It's so true. You're just like your mum and you're just like granddad. Yeah. Now it has to be done. I've got to give you guys props because as you know, with the PO box, right? This is like the PO box address. It says Tom Syndicate. And that's just because when people have been sending stuff to the PO box, it's usually been for me, but you can change the name to whoever you want it to go to. For example, look, someone sent something to my dad and put Ken Cassell on it. So I'll go and drop that off at my dad's house now. And then look at this. For Jenny and Eamon, like Lydia and I's friends, they're having a baby and someone sent them something. How sweet is that? So I think once I'm finished here at Carl's house, I'm going to be getting about like Postman Pat again. Right, before I go, Carl, I'm opening this massive jelly cat box because I, can, I cannot accept that this will just be for me. I've got a feeling it's going to be for Alice as well. Wait, so, I, I could be wrong. What do you say? What's Alice's in mind? So technically, <laughs> if you open it now, it's for me and Alice. Yeah, right? no, no, that's true. But I think you'll deal with the fact that if there's not anything for... Alice, yeah. you are hallowing it. You won't start kicking off. Right, so don't worry. This isn't going to be like another massive long PO box unboxing thing. But we have been sent... Okay, there's no card in there. We have been sent a big box with a jelly cat box inside it. Oh, what's that, Arlo? <laughs> so I've not got a letter yet, but if we open that up... <gasps> Mate, there's three things in it. <gasps> there's four. The one, two, three... Oh my gosh, and four, there's actually four items in here, and it says, with a jelly cat in your belly and a cat inside your heart, enjoy some soft and silly fun with your brand new jelly cat. And we've got a letter, so if we take a look at this real quick, it says, dun, 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 dun. hey, Tom, Lydia, little jelly man, and the, and the best, Alice. 
What the heck? What? Congratulations. Y'all are going to uh, be great parents. I think that's me and Lydia, unless you've got something to tell me. <laughs> You're well, going to be like, <laughs> 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 All right. There's a little dino. There is a little dino there for Arlo. Let's be honest. It's for Alice sending love from Glasgow from Erin. Wait a minute. So there's a little dino in there. So are these... Is it all for Alice? I'm glad your reading skills works out there. So Erin from Glasgow, from Glasgow. 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 Wait, you, you're an official bogus gas man now. Yeah, yeah. Well, you're not bogus then, are you? No, 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 no. I am a she gas man. A I am a legitimate <laughs> gas man. Yeah, yeah. And I'm in. Oh, and, well, I'm Ryan Blurry. Yeah, right, yeah Ryan Blurry. Just a bit gas man, mate. I don't set your goose. <laughs> How has it come full circle after all these years? Bogus gas man's a real one, but Erin from Glasgow, thank you so much for this. And as Carl was right in reading that, if I put you down, we've been sent this, which in it, oh, this has got to be for Arlo. This is a little dinosaur, Are you ready? Ready, Arlo, this is yours, this is yours. Mate. Oh, look at the dino! Do you want to give it to him? Oh! This is baby dino. Goes <laughs> rah. Kisses for dino. <laughs> Oh, that's adorable. That is so cute. Erin, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. But we've got another bag here. If we open this one up real quick. Inside there. Oh! Brother, that is so cute. Wait, I didn't know they did this. It's a koala, but it's like a koala with a little blanket in front of it. Or unless it's supposed to be holding a tree. I think it might be the holding a tree thing. I could be wrong. They are adorable, but it doesn't stop there. We've got another bag, and inside this... There's a book which says, my dad and me. Oh, that's adorable. I'm going to, there's no note that says these are for anyone particular. So I'm going to take these home and show Lydia. That is so cute. And then there's another one. Oh, Erin, that is so nice. Wait, what the heck is this? What? Oh, this looks good. This I didn't know Jelly Cat did box, like boxes like this. It's a, some rabbit boxing. Where... Oh, Lydia's going to love that. Oh my gosh, I didn't know they did that. A jelly cat, 100% cotton blanket. Erin, you're a legend. Girl, my heart, dude. My heart. You are the cutest little thing in the world. Where are you going? Where? <laughs> that is the best thing ever. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. You're so grown up. That is one of my favorite things I've ever seen you do. Standing up! Yes! Dude, I'm so proud of you. I cannot wait to be a dad. I cannot wait to be a dad! <laughs> Look who's turned up mum's home for bath time! Oh, Alice is know. the best. Yes! Come on, come back out. Where are you? Where are you? Best thing ever. What a shock. Alice has managed to come home and as I'm leaving with the <laughs> with the only ones that are left in the house, she's ransacking them. But oh, Alice has you. discovered, show them, what have I already got? So you've already got this book. I apparently already have this book. I've got the memory of a goldfish, so yeah. I wouldn't have a clue. But I've already got this book. And Uncle Tom bought our little, this little dinosaur. Which, from, yeah. <laughs> which I forgot. So therefore... We're going to do a trade. do a little trade. Yes! Now I've got a dinosaur. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh Yeah, Erin. get the note, get the note. Shout out to... To Erin. Erin. Glasgow. From Glasgow. Again, I, I would have remembered the name. I'm actually so excited because I don't have it's that. Really and that's freaking yeah, cute. You got it, brother. I knew that. Cute. Thank you, Erin. Yeah! I'm so glad I've put the rest in my Defender because yeah, you, you would have ransacked all of it. Oh. I'm going. <laughs> I'm trying to go. What are you trying to show me? Right, got a Oh! A t-shirt. Samples for the new summer collection. Blanks. Ooh! That's too long. This yeah, one, that, this one's that's a bit too bright, so we, I don't think we want that one. For the sand. Mm, that might be the vibe. Guys, is that a good design for the sand that's design? Cool, if we put the design on screen right now, is that the right colour? Yes? I think we need to do a vote. Oh, we were going to do it as like a lilac. I like that. Wait, why am I so zoomed in? I, I like that. Yeah, I, like that I think I would wear that. Because I, I don't quite like grey. Like yeah, but it's not quite grey, so it's like a good bit of colour in it. Ooh, I like that one. Yeah, okay. Fit, yes. Right. And what's this one? That's nice. That's nice. It's very good. And that's oversized. Fit. Very good. So I'll bring him to work tomorrow. Thank you. Oh my god, I felt absolutely terrible. What now? Get out of my way. 
I'm about to make someone's day. Oh. 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 Wow, what is it? I, I don't know, but hopefully you like it. I think it's a double chocolate chip cookie. Oh, the, Rita's, uh, the Piccadilly Beaks. Is it? Yeah, it's the... I thought... Just for context, I thought I'd given them all away and not given Carl one. I just got in my car and realised I've still got one. I think that's a Thanks, Tom. Thanks there you go, bro. <laughs> I just got in my car and was like, oh my god! Oh, thank god for that. I honestly felt so bad because I was like, oh, Carl, I've got you uh, nothing. But all right, time to go and be Postman Tom. Okay, stop number one. I believe we've got a parcel for a one and only Ken Cassell. Oh, and what a bloody shock is coming out when I arrive. Hello there. Hello, it is me, Postman Tom. I bring you present. Oh! What is it? I'm actually very interested. Oh. Oh? Could be a bomb. Oh, well, that's... What? Well, diffuse it. You've got all the tools. I have not a clue what it is. What? I don't even know you're getting something said. That's nice. What? That's what? very nice. What is it? What have you been... Oh? Moretti glass. Is it? Yeah. Wait, Madri glass. Madri. If you guys are sending stuff, you need to send letters. What does it say? L. Oh! legend, Ken. Keeping drinking mad mandris. <laughs> <laughs> Who sent that? Abs absolute legend Ken keeping drinking madris. Brilliant. Absolutely top dollar. <laughs> it will be this company, a specialist engraving company limited, unit one, Woodville, Cardiff. All yeah. the way from Vales. Well, that's my postman job done. Enjoy a drink. I'm sorry I didn't bring you any beer. I didn't know what it was. I'm not going to put that behind the bar at the grapes. I'll get smashed. Yeah, don't do that. I'm lost. <laughs> Going in my hey, I've got to go. I've got other deliveries to make. See what's in here? That was for Tom. I found that in the bag as well. Well, I love my job. Honestly, I got the PO box in from Alice's house and I was like, Ken Cassell? I was like, I'll get it straight down to him. <laughs> bye bye now. And arriving at destination numero two. <laughs> the Irish. Right, mate. Sorry, I haven't. I, I, I can't believe I've not got my magnets on, but I bring you delivery. delivery I yes, bring in your yes, gift. Yes, uh, I, no, I have a post for you. A post for me? I bring post, seriously. <laughs> Can you notice one thing about this that you're probably not too happy about? <laughs> Man, they spelt your name right. Of course I'm happy with this. You <laughs> spelled my name wrong all <laughs> No, no, it wasn't me spelling it. J and end with cat. You think it's a jelly cat? Bro, I have no idea. Oh, can you feel it? It has to be, surely. I have no idea. Everybody's on this jelly cat hype. It's got to be. What is it? Oh, are they? What have you been sent? Oh, my God. By the way, I totally look like I'm setting this up as if I know what it is, but I genuinely don't. <laughs> what is it? Oh, that's lovely! Is it a jelly cat? <laughs> yeah, of course it is. Aaron and Jenny, massive congratulations on your news. We are super excited to see your baby girl on Tom's squad. Hopefully, you will make great parents. And I know Tom and Lydia will be there with their little jelly man along oh. the way too. Lots of love from Joe and John Richard from... Joe and John! From what? what? Worcester? Worcester? Worcester! Worcestershire! Worcestershire. No! They <laughs> sent me something today! No way! Aww. Oh, that's adorable! <laughs> yes! Yeah, the boy. <laughs> yeah, that, that, yeah, thank you guys. Beautiful. You're too cute. You're too cute. Oh. And just like that, another delivery done. And now to get this lot from here, down here. But you know what? I'm not going to take this one down. I want to open it because it says to Tom and Arlo, but it says no jelly cuts inside this box. I love it. This one's staying out whilst I sit in the massage chair and unbox it. And Lydia's not currently in the house right now, but I guess she's been enjoying some TV. She's been watching Gossip Girl. Oh, no. Oh, no, lads. You know what that means? Season one, episode one. I know for a fact she's seen this show about six times. It means she's about to be on a Netflix binge. Oh, bloody hell. And like I said to you guys, the letters don't go downstairs. They stay upstairs so I can read them straight away. But as for the massive bag of jelly cats, guys, that, that is absurd. Like, What have you done? What have you done? Like, when we've talked about doing the P.O. Box, like, massive unboxing videos, the hype and support has been, everyone's been like, we want to see it, we want it done, get it going straight away. And we're trying to work on it. We've literally got the first video being worked on as we speak. But I swear, we didn't even unbox half of this amount before that even video goes out. What? Now, hold up. Wait a second for me to say 
would you just look at that view? Oh my gosh, Lydia's out at the moment, so I thought, I'll grab a blanket, I'll grab a beer and I'll go and kick a fat chill in the garden. But oh my gosh, look at that view. That is absolutely balmy. That before when the old trees were here, I wouldn't have been able to see that because they would have been so tall. It's absolutely beautiful. But hey up, not as beautiful as the grass. You can actually start to see it. Look at it in patches. Wow, wow, we were. Wow, wow, we were. It is very green. Oh my gosh. The Whoa, that's a freaking lot of sheep over there. Look at them. But look at this. The grass is actually starting to grow. I can't believe it. And more so, the trees are looking absolutely amazing. Which reminds me, I need to get those price tags off because I don't want the trees growing and then being like suffocated by a piece of plastic and then like snapping off in the future. But wow, I, like I said previously, I thought it was going to take months to start seeing the grass growing, but look at that patch over there. It's poking through already. And I, I was going to sit on the grass, but it's a little bit wet. So I'm going to go sit on the hot tub. Would be nicer to get in the hot tub. But um, yeah, we won't talk about that. Because <laughs> shock is broken. But listen, I'll add it to the list of things to do. Because you've seen it. I'm getting proactive and getting shit done in the house. But wait, why am I sitting on the hot tub when I've got a chair there? Come, come, come. Come, 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 come. I can sit down, put my feet up on this. And look out over the sunset. Look at that. Look a nuke's got off. Got my own screening to Oppenheimer Tom Edition. Only about 40 minutes later, <laughs> the sun's completely gone and I look like I'm about to get rained on. It's also extremely cold the second that sun disappeared, which makes a lot of sense. I got blanket and everything, but um, I don't think the blanket's going to save me for the rain, so I'm going inside. Now, I'm just inside my office because I'm just like reading your guys' comments, and my sister's texted me, and she's texted me the most amazing thing ever. I, I wasn't even expecting it. I wasn't even talking to her. She just randomly texted me and she sent me this text. And I, and I was just like, <laughs> totally caught off guard and hitting the feels. I'm still hitting the feels because I've rewatched back um, yesterday's vlog with Deck. And I kind of didn't want to get all emotional in that vlog um, because. Well, I knew he was going to see it. Maybe he won't see this one late into this one because he'd be like, yeah, I'm going to click off this video now, but man, I am, I'm so blessed. I am so bloody blessed. I got a bit angry today though, which is not really like me, but I had to put out like a bit of a tweet because unlike yesterday's vlog, I had the most amazing day. I spent it with Deck, who is just this like, absolutely dope dude like really puts you into perspective of like what's important and not to get caught up in bullshit and like legit material things in any sort of way of you think you want something in life but you don't realize what you've got is just the best thing in the world and that is just your health and your happiness and to meet someone like debt was just amazing but I made the vlog go live yet today, or yesterday for you guys now. The amount of comments of people straight away being like, what the fuck, Tom? Only a 20 minute vlog. This isn't, this isn't like what you usually do. Where's the long videos? And I'm like, oh man. Like, I would so just rather people like, sort of like think before they speak. Cause the whole point of my day yesterday was to spend it with deck. It wasn't to even vlog. The fact that there was even a 20 minute video blows my mind because usually when i do i'd be like you know really busy you probably get like a four minute vlog because these videos are supposed to be max 10 20 minutes the fact that they're 49 29 52 43 57 like minutes long is an absolute madness and they're not supposed to be that long that's me over filming orion would would behead me if he could for the amount of footage that i send him and the thing is i send him more and he cuts it out like most of the time if a video is an hour long that means i've sent him like two hours worth of footage and he's deleted a load of it explosion and i'm not lying when i say this because look six years ago 10 minutes 14 minutes 11 8 5 8 Two minutes 44? I couldn't even tell you what I could have possibly have done in that day for it to be so short. But I need to say more than anything, a thank you for those of you who understood the point of yesterday's vlog. I wanted to spend the day with Deck. I wanted to get to know him. I wanted to hear his story. I wanted to spend some time with him. It, it wasn't even about putting a video out that day. But as you know... I want to hold myself accountable to be able to upload a new vlog 
every single week. Di- week. Of- mm-hmm. Sorry, it kind of stopped working there, but I want to upload a brand new vlog for your guys' faces every single weekday at 7 p.m. ish. And for those of you who kind of got it and understood that there was more of a meaning to yesterday's vlog being shorter, it wasn't due to me being lazy or anything like that. It's that I wanted to put my time and attention into the right place. So honestly, to those of you who didn't jump the gun in the comments, I'll be like, oh, why is it a short video? Thank you. I appreciate you. And more so, you're the real ones. Not gonna lie, kinda intrigued as to what was going on with this two minute 44 long vlog. But you know what? If you wanna see what that was, I'm gonna let you search for it and you tell me if I was right in assuming I was probably up all night, live streaming, gaming, and then got out of bed at like nine o'clock in the evening and realized, shit, I need to get out a daily vlog. Cause that was what the grind was all about back then. Look, even in the description it says, and the award for the world's shortest vlog goes to this guy. Like honestly, the pressure I felt back in the day of trying to upload a daily vlog was insane. Be sometimes where I'm like in the middle of a desert and I'd have no signal whatsoever that I'd be like, oh my gosh, I am going to miss like the pressure of uploading. And I think like we all understand now, like if I miss a day for whatever reason now, it's due to some sort of circumstance, but Wow. I don't think I'd ever want to go back to it. But man, I've just realised scrolling this far back, I'm finding so many videos of my granddad. And it's here, me in the fields. If I fall from, I smell the presence of Gordon Spencer. What are you doing here? I've come here so you can open your present. Damn right you have. I think... This is why I vlog. Memories. Memories forever. It's a remote control car and it's a jagged. No. Oh. Ooh. Look at the disappointment. Oh, look. Not a jag. Don't it's tell him about it. Don't tell him about it. Remote control car. Probably his other one. How did you make the remote control car? I can tell by the box because it's pretty good. It's a remote control car and the light keeps on. For fuck's sake, I miss him. Right, it is 10.47. It's about that time that I stop being soppy and I say this. If you guys enjoy these videos, do me a favour. Leave a like, Crane. I know there's a lot of you watch this stuff on a TV and it's hard for you to do so, but if with your remote or whatever, you can click a like rating on this, like jiggle it around and look for the thumbs up. If you could press that if you're watching this on a TV, I would really appreciate it because you don't understand how much it helps the video. But more importantly... If you're not subscribed, click the subscribe button, ding on the notification bell, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Will I? Yeah, I'll see you tomorrow at 7 p.m. ish for the next weekday vlog. Wait, will I? Wait, this is Thursday going into Friday. Yeah, <laughs> I'm just checking because if I said that tomorrow on a Friday, I won't see you till Monday. And if I'm right in saying Orion has got the first P.O. Box unboxing video ready, I think. Explosion. Uh, which might be going out on Sunday. Now, I'm just preempting this. I've not seen it, and I'm not expecting it to be like the best video that everyone ever wants to tune into in their lives, but it's been requested so much that I thought it'd be a disservice to not do it. So, PO Box unboxing coming out for your faces. I feel like if it doesn't really work, I think the better thing to do would to be a, doing a live stream. Would you guys be interested in me doing a a live stream on the channel, like with my even my friends and my family, and we do a PO Box unboxing thing, because then that way it can take all the time in the world to do it. You can tune in, you can skip through it or whatnot, but I thought it'd be a pretty interesting concept if it's better than doing a video. We could do like a, a live stream that you could watch the VOD afterwards. But yeah, just throwing that out there, it's an idea, but I need to go, because I need to get my shit together, because at 10 o'clock in the morning, tomorrow, I've got a very important meeting with a kitchen designer. Ooh, we're getting shit done. And hopefully sorting out the next, oh my gosh. Tomorrow at one o'clock, the new furniture gets delivered. I almost forgot. Right, tune in tomorrow. I'll see you guys then. Much love to your faces. Until next time, much love. And as always, sa di